elementary school in Brown County is in some hot water over a letter that was sent home with students earlier this month. That letter gave parents an option to not have their kids be a part of lessons about black history. Earlier today, I went to Brown County to get reaction on this letter from the community and the school district itself. The school sent out this letter to parents telling them that in honor of Black History Month and Valentine's Day, they would be teaching lessons related to equity, caring, and understanding differences. Then the letter gave parents an option to remove their students from these lessons if they choose. People in this small rural community are divided on the issue. I think that is really absurd. I think it's backwards. How to have their choice to really. Why is that? Why do you do that? Because they're the ones that are raising their children. The letter comes as a bill is making its way through the Indiana State House that would give parents more input on what their children learn in school. Taiwan Garrett with the Indianapolis area chapter of the NAACP calls the letter and overall movement disheartening. But when you see that opt out, it makes it seem like the intention was exactly I don't want these students to learn about history in the African-American experience. Garrett says black Americans are an essential part of this country's history, and he says allowing parents to opt out is a slippery slope. My religion doesn't believe in war, so I want to opt out of learning about the Civil War, World War I, World War II. For its part, the district said it supports the teaching of historical injustices and wants to create a welcoming environment. The superintendent said in a statement, quote, We do not allow students and parents to opt out of required curriculum, including instruction on social studies and histories. Any decision related to parental consent and curriculum determinations are made in accordance with the law. The district said it is looking into this situation to find out the justification for the language that was used in that letter. District leaders say they would respond to any continuing concerns that parents might have.